Hey everyone, welcome back to Inside Sleep Reviews. Today we're doing something a little bit different. We've got an adjustable bed frame to take a look at. This is the Lucid 300 series. We've got two twin size frames. Check out the links below on Amazon for all the specs and the pricing. Lucid is one of the first companies we ever worked with and we loved their products. And our daughter still sleeps on a Lucid bed, so and she loves it. Um, we're excited to take a look at these bed frames. We have been wanting one for a while, the adjustable kind but we were kind of scared off by the price point. And these two were the best price uh, by far that we saw. So we're really excited to get them and take a look. The setup is supposed to be really easy. So we're going to stick around and give an inside look at how everything works out. Stay tuned. Getting the box off of the bed frame was a cinch. All we had to do was cut off the wrappings. Uh, now we're gonna take a look at the inside of the bed. So this is the bottom of the bed frame and you've got a little, uh, a little holder here for the support. So we're gonna open it up and take a look at the inside. Now again, this is heavy. So be real careful while handling the actual equipment because it is uh, pretty substantially constructed. So um, we've got really nice upholstery here. It feels really high quality. Um, there is a box of parts. These are probably gonna be the supports and additional legs for underneath the bed. got um, an instruction manual and then it looks like you have we have an adapter and also four additional support legs for underneath the bed and then this one looks like batteries uh, oh and the remote control so it comes uh, with all the parts that you need let's see what else is here so I see you have all the motors here, you've got USB ports, um, and also you have an additional support for the mattress. Obviously you wanna make sure the mattress doesn't slide off the frame, so this support uh, attaches to the edge of the bed for that, uh, for that purpose. Let me see here. And this is what we would plug into that little support that we saw earlier to keep the mattress from sliding off the bed frame. Uh, you have the motors here. Um, we think this is gonna be the foot of the bed and that's gonna be the head. So we need to figure out a way to turn it around and install it inside our bed frame. So stay tuned, we are gonna do just that in a minute. We have our bed frame completely out of the box and we were uh, brainstorming some ways to safely get it into the bed frame where we can install it. And we actually discovered that these legs screw off, they're removable. So for us, that's perfect because we could actually slide this, bed, uh, this adjustable bed frame underneath our current bed frame and that way we don't have to do any lifting. So that makes things a lot easier for us. The motor is about four inches off the ground. So um, if, you are, if you're gonna do this, you need about four inches of clearance uh, underneath your bed in order to slide it under. So let's, uh, let's see how this works. Before we flip our frame over, we wanted to give you a final look at the guts underneath to see how everything works. So um, this bed comes with actually four USB ports and they're on either side. You can use them to charge your phones, your tablets, or you can even add LED lights underneath. So that's a really useful feature. Uh, you've got the two motors, one for the foot, one for the head. And uh, those are gonna be there to, of course, lift, uh, lift and, and lower the bed as you see fit. And of course you have the power adapter that's all the way over there. There's only three things that you need. Uh, to do. The first thing you need to do is of course get the frame out of the box. The second thing is to screw in the legs um, into the desired positions and then what you do is you plug in the adapter and which of course will 
supply power to the bed. Once the adapter is connected, you're ready to flip your frame over. And then all you have to do is plug it in and you're ready to go. Last thing to do is to install the retainer bars and then we're good to go. So we've got our bed frame all set up. It looks great. We're really excited about it, but we do want to mention one thing and that is the dimensions. Um, both of these bed frames are 37.5 each, so it adds up to 75 total in width. This fit exactly right into our existing furniture. So you want to check your furniture to make sure that they do fit. A lot of competitors, um, they, they're off by an inch, maybe they're 38, they're 39. If these had been off by another inch, it would not have fit in our furniture and it would have been a big mess. Um, the length is 79.5 inches and again, we're looking at 37.5 per frame because uh, we got two twins because we have a king. So it adds up together to be 75 inches wide. And again, this fit perfectly in our furniture. The upholstery we're really happy with. It's high quality and very grown up looking. The gray color is very classic. Um, and then there's a high quality material here. It feels like it's gonna last forever. So we're very impressed with the, with the materials and the way it's constructed. And again, it just fit perfectly inside our, our, our existing bed frame. Uh, so we're pretty thrilled about that. Let's have a look at the remotes that came with the bed. On the back is the battery compartment. It comes with two AAA batteries. Just make sure you put them in the right direction. The remote also has a really useful feature, which is a flashlight. We thought that was pretty great. Um, the button is in the front. All you gotta do is just turn it on and turn it off. Uh, you've also got the two up buttons, and the two down buttons, one for the head, one for the feet. That's pretty self-explanatory. There's a memory button if you wanna save a particular position. And of course, there's a flat button. So if you wanna bring your bed back down to the flat position, all you have to do is press that button and everything goes down to flat. We wanted to show you guys the moving parts of the bed before we loaded our mattress on here. Each section can take on 750 pounds of weight and that's including the mattress and the person sleeping on it. So it's plenty of strength to withstand uh, pretty much any person who sleeps on these beds. Um, so let's take a look at the motor and see how far up the bed can go from the head and the foot and how fast it moves. So as you can see, it moves along at a pretty comfortable pace, not too fast, not too slow. And the head, and this is the head coming up. So it does come up pretty significantly. So you'll, you'll be in a comfortable sitting position as you watch TV or eat in bed or read or do all your activities. So this is the maximum this is, this is as far up as the bed will go. So let's bring it back down to flat and see how, how long it takes to come back down to a completely flat position. So as you can see, the speed is pretty steady. Um, it's fast enough to not be tedious, but it's slow enough to still be comfortable. Um, right now we have two remotes for each side. Uh, since we have two twins because we have a king size uh, we have a king size bed but we are going to show you how to pair one remote to work both halves at the same time so as you can see this remote only controls one of the bed frames and we want to make it so that it controls both the bed frames at one time so we don't have one half of the bed elevated which is super uncomfortable so we're going to pair this remote like this you're going to press the two up buttons at the same time And then hit the blue button on the control box. And then once you hear the beeps, they're both paired. Very cool. So now we have the remote, we have uh, the remote that controls both halves at once and they move as one piece. 
So now that we've got our mattress loaded back onto the bed frame, we're going to show you how the motors work with the mattress on it as well as two bodies on top of it. So first we're going to go up. As you can see, the motors work great. It comes up nice and slow and steady. Then we're going to come up on the feet too. Again, the motor is just very strong. Comes up nice and steady, super comfortable. And then we're going to go back to flat. Oh, up a little more. So as you can see, the motors handle two sleepers and a king size mattress just fine. Our mattress is 13 inches thick, probably weighs about uh, over 100 pounds. So it's pretty, um, it's, it's, it's a pretty substantial mattress and the motors have no problem uh, raising and lowering anything. Let's go back flat. Let's go back down to flat. Pretty cool stuff. We love this bed frame. It's so comfortable. It's gonna make watching TV easier. Um, if we have reflux, we could raise our heads. If uh, we wanna raise our feet to maybe ease some pressure on our backs, we could do that too. This is gonna be great for our health. Um, we love everything about the setup. Uh, it was easy. The price point was terrific. And overall, this is just the best adjustable bed frame that we can recommend. Some final thoughts. This Lucid bed frame comes with a warranty that's bumper to bumper for the first three years. The price point is amazing. You will not find a bed frame of this quality for this price point, period. We loved everything about the setup. It was easy and quick. And uh, Lucid is also doing a giveaway after this video. So all you have to do is like, comment, and subscribe, and Lucid will pick a lucky winner to send one twin size foldable mattress to. So it's not an inflatable mattress, it's a foldable mattress, and it's great for campouts and playrooms. So we really enjoyed sharing this with you. We hope the video was useful. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys next time.